Now that I've talked about both MRAs and feminists, I want to get to the core of this issue. Humanism. Feminists, MRAs, we're talking about the same topic. That's, that's the core of this. When we eliminate the extremists from the equation, which is why I did my previous videos, by the way, calling out the extremists on both sides, is because if we eliminate them from this discussion, we come to a simple conclusion. Feminists and MRAs want the same thing, at least the moderates do, which is equality between the sexes. And we can all agree, I think, that this is a reasonable and rational desire, that to have equality between the two genders is good. We should strive for this. But when we have the MRAs and the feminists, even the moderates, just them, we have a problem, which is that we are dividing this discussion unnecessarily. We're taking it as an issue of feminists talking about the feminist issues, MRAs talking about the men's issues, but they're not different in reality. They're not really different. Yeah, sure, women have certain issues that men don't and vice versa, but take all that aside because it's not really what any of them are talking about. What they're talking about is equality. What they're talking about is respect. Simple and true. And when we have that discussion, both sides could get together and say, it's not about women, it's not about men, it's about people. It's about treating fellow humanity with respect. Anybody who is a human being, who is not somehow harmful or destructive in some way towards other people, is worthy of a basic level of respect and decency. Man, woman, black, white, whatever, it doesn't matter. And to cut the argument into two separate factions is pointless. It, I mean, let's leave that shit to the Republicans and the Democrats in the White House, right, in Congress. They're, they can argue over non-existent divisions, right? That We have people for that already. What we have here is a real issue that needs to be fixed. We don't need all of this banter back and forth about, well, men have it worse, well, women have it worse, blah, blah, blah. You know, one side could have it worse than the other, and I honestly do have an opinion on that, but that's not the point here. The point is that both sides have issues, both sides have legitimate arguments, and both sides, the moderates there, at least, want to see a resolution that makes both sides work together in a conclusive whole where everyone is equal. It's simple. It's easy, actually. It, it almost feels like I'm sitting here staring at an obvious answer that no one else wants to really look at. But I know there are other humanists out there, people who look beyond these almost trivial at times, divisions between humans, and sees people as a whole, as a mess of people together trying to figure this shit out and live together. Because let's, let's face it, you're not going to get rid of the women or the men, depending on which side you're here for. You're not going to get rid of them, you're not going to make them go away, you're not going to somehow just subjugate them or deal with them in some negative manner. They're just going to be there and you have to live with them. One way or the other. And I think the moderates on both sides here can get together and say, it's not about women, it's not about men, it's about people, and work together, simple and clean, working together to make an issue resolved. It's not hard, only as hard as we make it. If we sit there and say, well, it's about my side, I need to be on the winning side, or my side needs to have more power or anything like that. If you turn it into a power play or a struggle between the genders here, then you've already missed the point, which is if you want equality, it can't be about superiority. It can't be about having power over the other group. If you want equality, you have to extend an arm of friendship and say, let's be equal. It, it really can't progress beyond anything else until it, that initial hurdle is set. Until people can sit there and say, it's not about the divisions, it's about what draws us together in commonality, then you're not solving the issue. It's that simple. After all, you cannot solve a whole problem by addressing half of its cause. You can't. It's stupid. You can only address a problem by addressing all of the causes of the problem. And both genders are causes of the problem. 
just as both genders when working together are the solution. Because then, if working together, they're humans. They're just people together working towards a common cause. And isn't that what we've been doing, really, since the beginning of civilization? If we could conquer all of the world, make it ours, right? Working together in common cause, then I think if we put aside our differences and actually have a discussion between the moderates, civil, and in agreement, we can actually solve this one, too. Just something to think about.